So today I thought we'd revisit a classic meme. This video or set of videos has kind of been like a joke on my channel for a while, but I've never actually made a full video on the topic. But today I just thought, fuck it, let's make a video on this. And of course I'm talking about Smithy Boy and the crew. Now, if you don't know who Smithy Boy and the crew are, then where the fuck have you been? These guys are national heroes. Now, the Smithy Boy and the crew videos are fairly old. I think they're about two years old. But honestly, to me at least, they never get old. They're just such an accurate representation of Britain as a whole. And if you don't believe me, then just watch. Okay, so to start with, we're just going to be jumping into the first original Smithy Boy and the crew video. Now, from what I can tell, this is the only video with the whole crew in it. You know, all the other Smithy Boy and the crew videos just have Smithy Boy and L dot. But this one's got the entire crew. And fucking L, they're an intimidating crew. So let's jump right into this. Yo, how that? Smithy boy. Money my squad. Check it man. Yo, safe we. Whoa, whoa, we went. Yo. Yo. See, I told you this was an accurate representation of Britain. Some random 20-year-old man hanging around with a couple of 11-year-olds that are fucking smoking cigarettes. Now, if you can link me a more British video than this, I'd be very surprised. And as for the 20-year-old hanging around with a group of 11-year-olds, believe it or not, in Britain, that's not a rare sight at all. And usually you think that that's like the older brother or something. A lot of the time, it's just some random 20-year-old that sells them weed or something. Don't get a fuck if I'm on the mic, because I'm just like, push to the door for the straight man. Look at the boys just sitting on a garage. That's it, man, because you know what you'll get, you can tell they've been waiting on that shed for a while just to get the queue to jump down and join the crew. Like, honestly, who volunteered to join this crew? I mean, I can understand maybe an 11 year old thinking this might be a good idea, but surely Eldot, a 20 year old man, should be able to tell that making this video was a fucking terrible idea. That's it, man. I'm telling you about that. Don't get a fuck if you're in the factory. That's it, look, because you don't get what? <laughs> That's my favourite part out of the whole video. Just the bit where L dot jumps over all the 11 year olds. What? Like, he thinks he's proper cool. He settled up, man, I get my guap. Top of the block, man, I get a drop because I'm top of the beat. Go give a fuck if you think you can fuck with me. Yeah. Back onto the ends and I stack that P. Oh, yeah, L dot, I can tell you stack that P. You know, you can tell someone stacks bare P's when he's hanging around with a group of 11 year olds and sharing a fucking cigarette with them. Go tell a mic to that OT1. We all know, shoot that I fucked your mum on a dip in a bush, man. Oh, the funny, because I swear down blood, the boy, and it's a tranny. Who's oh, gonna say, to the this kid looks lost. I think he's joined the wrong crew here. I mean, he's supposed to be joining the Minecraft crew. He probably just realised it's nearly his curfew and that he needs to go home. But he has to finish filming this video with Smithy Boy. Bloody hell, mate, you're proper solid. Fucking swearing at the camera. I mean, just sitting here watching this video, I feel intimidated. Well, if it is, and I make that noise, call to the right, call to the left, two, three dogs, and the door to the fuck desk gets. <laughs> <laughs> There's just some random guy in the background who just doesn't want to be involved. He doesn't even want to know. He's just like, fuck this shit. I'm fucking done with this area. Talk about skets and little dog hounds. I swear down, blood, I'll be earning like 50 pounds, man, 50 cents, man, 50 pence. That's it, blood, man, sitting on a bench. Don't get a fuck if you get shanked with a more fucking garden range. Chilling with me, man, chilling with Tyler. I swear down, let you out the gate like a rock way. Like <laughs> okay, so in my last video, I talked about beef between Little T and Sophie Aspen. But I think Little T should just cut off Sophie Aspen and leave her and send a diss track to Smithy Boy. Because that is a rap beef I'd like to. To see. Hope you see this man, cause your bars are so shit, man. You can't even spit. <laughs> Swear on blood, I'll <laughs> in it. You can tell he regretted saying brat <laughs> immediately after saying it. Tell you what, blood, I'm gonna have you. Have you like a what man in an alley? Cause I swear on blood, you. I'll pull down the kegs, man. Just whack it in, cause I swear on blood, I'm in a biscuit. Yeah. Good. Good man. I and that's the best thing that has ever come out of England. You know, a while back I said bro men were the best thing that came out of England. But I take that back. Smithy boy is definitely the best thing that's come out of England. Oh, and do you want to know why he runs away at the end of the video? Apparently it's because he had to go and buy some weed. Like, I'm not even fucking around. These guys did an interview with Smithy boy and he legit said that he needs to go off and buy some weed. Why did you run away at the end of the video? Pick up some weed. Okay, so anyway, let's get on to the crew's next video. Now, I found this one on Smithy Boy's official YouTube channel. And yes, he has his own YouTube channel. And it's fucking great. He's got a few solo songs on there. But I'm not going to be looking at them. I'm only interested in the ones he does with the crew. So let's watch Smithy Boy and the crew police rap. Smithy yeah. Boy. Okay, so it seems L Dot and Smithy Boy have found a police car. And you know, it's obvious L Dot and Smithy Boy have had some hardships with police in the past. You know, they've been very unjust towards them. But anyway, L Dot and Smithy Boy think it's a good idea to rap in front of a police car saying how much they hate the police. So let's give it a watch. Yo. You can't about that, man. <laughs> it's L Dot. What? <laughs> Yo. 
sit to the right, <laughs> sit to the left. You know, the police probably aren't too concerned about what he's saying about them. They're probably just wondering why a fully grown man's hanging around with an 11 year old. Really don't give two fuck about these feds when they're looking at my head, looking at my beat, and I've gone for the street. Yo, what well, have I set? What do you want to do to me? <laughs> but you can tell he's really fucking nervous because he gets really close to the camera and goes pretty quiet. But anyway, after L Dot's done, Spiffy Boy comes in. And if you thought L Dot was good, just take a listen to Spiffy Boy. Go in the bush, yo. <laughs> <laughs> he literally says three words. Oh, but he's not done. He comes back for more. He's literally standing about a millimeter away from the camera because he doesn't want the police to hear him, otherwise, they'll probably tell his mum. <laughs> And that's the end of the video. It was only about 40 seconds. You know, I'm guessing they both got arrested afterwards and got thrown in prison for life for spitting weak bars. Okay, but anyway, let's have a look at Smithy Boy and L Dot's next video, Street Style. Now, this one isn't really a Smithy Boy and the Crew video, but to be honest, L Dot and Smithy Boy are the only ones that really contribute to the crew. The rest of them just kind of stand around. I don't know, I guess they're trying to look intimidating or something. But anyway, let's get into Smithy Boy featuring L Dot, Street Style. Yeah. Zelda. Smithy boy. Smithy boy. Okay, so the video starts off with our two heroes, L Dot and Smithy boy, standing in front of a wall, holding what looks like a portable speaker. I mean, you can tell it's going to be fire when the instrumentals come out of a portable speaker. That's like one step above blasting out of your fucking phone. Let me watch this bully get bullied with a vibe, because I'll keep it a grab, I'll keep it a beat, but I chill with Smithy boy any day of the week. We get a pee, we get a guap, what? He's saying that he'd chill out with Smithy boy any day of the week, and that they get a lot of money. <laughs> By doing what? I mean, Smithy boy's way too young to work so he can't get any money and i mean l dot i'm sorry mate but it's, it's quite obvious you're not employed <laughs> like no hate towards you or anything you know i could see you're trying to pursue your dream of becoming a sick mc but i'm just saying it's fairly obvious that you're unemployed when you're standing in front of a wall with an 11 year old spitting bars okay so after that point in the video i literally have no idea what's going on mainly because i'm pretty sure it's not in english but anyway throughout the song i'm pretty sure it's just talking about weed or whatever. I literally have no idea. And then at the end of the video, he like throws a spoon or something at the camera. Hear this little pussy on, yeah? Fuck you, man. <laughs> you know, lads, you probably shouldn't go near him. He's got a full arsenal of spoons that he's not afraid to use. But anyway, that's the end of the Smithy Boy and the Crew saga. He has got a load of solo songs, but yeah, I'm not really going to go into them. In this video, at least. But I found something really interesting a few months ago. Some guy managed to get an interview with Smithy Boy. I'm genuinely not sure how he managed to do that. But anyway, like, right at the start of the interview, he talks about how he went to court. And he's been put on six months probation for fucking burglary. How court go the other day? <laughs> Six Why? What would you do anyway? I didn't hear. Oh, right, well done, Spiffy Boy. Ever since I saw the first Spiffy Boy in the crew video, I knew you were destined for big things. But anyway, if you want to watch it, I'll leave a link to the interview in the description. If you're a Spiffy Boy enthusiast, I'd say it's well worth a watch. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. And like I say in all my videos, please don't send hate over to anyone. Like, I'm pretty sure Smithy Boy doesn't have any active accounts. But even if he doesn't, I'm not, like, hating on him or anything. So yeah, if you find any of his accounts or anything, don't send hate over to him. But anyway, guys, as I said, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please remember to subscribe and smash that motherfucking like button.